Hey, do you ever wonder why school buses are yellow and really haven't changed that much in 82 years? Well, exterior wise anyway. How about the three black stripes down the side? They're there for a reason. I also found a couple pictures of some older school buses I'll throw up here as well. But anyway, in the mid-30s, there were more and more school buses hitting the roads and somebody decided, hey, school bus safety needs to be improved. I definitely agree with that one. So starting by making yellow the universal color for school buses, which we know as today. So some of the biggest changes in school buses over the years is the safety, interior, um, they have rollover protection, safer fuel systems, and the seats are taller. The seats are also designed to absorb energy and cushion the impact in the event of an accident. Buses are also 70 times safer than cars. So what about the three stripes going down the side of the bus? Well, the first stripe is the floor. Second stripe is the seat. Third stripe is the top of the seat. Well, the top of the seat before the seats got higher. So they're there basically as a little bit of a reinforcement, as well as in the event of an accident, safety workers know exactly where to cut or avoid cutting. So that's what they're there for. Anyway, just a little video I thought I'd throw together. And for those of you that are wondering, nah, nobody's wondering, but I'll tell you anyway. Yes, I did drive school bus for a year, which I didn't mind. It was kind of a cool job, I guess. Anyway, hope you found this interesting. Uh, consider giving me a thumbs up. Hope everybody's having a great day. Long may you big jib draw, and thanks for watching.